my name is Nadia and in a week I'm moving into a college that I'm so so excited to attend but a year ago today I was overwhelmed and burnt out and I had a really harmful mindset going into the college admissions process in my mind I either got into my early decision school or I wouldn't get into anywhere and everything else would go horribly but the thing is if I could go back and tell myself some advice I'd want my younger self to know that you end up exactly where you're supposed to be. And I mean that really genuinely, because you find a community where you will be not only happy, but intellectually stimulated and where you can grow so much. So I wish I knew that things were going to work out better than I could have imagined. And I also wish I knew that even if things don't work out early on, there's months more for you to find out and there's going to be so much growth in the future. So as you can see in this video, there were a lot of really painful moments, but there were also so many moments that I'm incredibly grateful for. I had so much support from my family and friends and through the beginning when it was really hard, I couldn't have gone through that without them. So I really hope you enjoy these reactions and I hope you have a great college admissions process too. There are plans for you to be thriving and doing well. Okay. It's not gonna pop up immediately because you have to like sign in first to something else. Okay. I did not get it. Hi. <laughs> we just got Taco Bell. Yes. And now we're just gonna open this. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not surprised. I got deferred. <laughs> what? You didn't, you didn't get rejected? <laughs> but I'm not into college yet. It's okay. Thank you. Hi. We just did a hike. Um, and I just found out that Northeastern is out, so. For the record, I'm not into college yet. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, right. It's okay. just early action. Um, it's just early action. She's signing in. It doesn't really feel like an actual thing because... Because I don't think we wrote any... Yeah, we didn't write essays from the first year. Um, I don't. Can you give me an essay? You guys. Um, I was deferred. This is Michigan, and I have like a really sentimental connection to Michigan because so many of my family members and close friends go there, so I'm going to be devastated. <laughs> but anyways, um, I just hope it's, I hope it's finally good news. Have you logged in to your account? I think it's no, logged in. No, I haven't even done that, sorry. Because apparently it shows up right when you... Yeah, but once you log in. I think you got this. I think you're gonna get it. I, there's no way. I got it. Yeah! <laughs> oh my god. I was gonna say, especially given, and then I was like, Okay. <laughs> I can't really breathe right now because um, I was just like opening up my, I was going through my email because I don't know, I just got home from school and I. Like I open up my email and I see this thing from Berkeley. So I click on it because I'm like, oh, I'm probably missing my mid-year transcript or something of that sort. And I open it and there's confetti and I realize that I got into Berkeley. Um, so yeah, basically I'm kind of freaking out right now. And then I was just on the phone with my dad and I opened up something else because it said, make sure to open up your conditions of admission. And there was more con there was more confetti and it said congratulations and welcome to the University of California Berkeley um and then it said something about um 
Okay, I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm not thinking coherently. Basically, it said that I've been selected to interview for the Regents and Chancellor Scholarship. So I could be getting um, like a scholarship to Berkeley as well. So I feel so grateful right now because I was having a really rough day and I was so upset all day. I was thinking it's one of the worst days that I've had in a while. And this just completely turned it around for me because this was so unexpected. And I just feel so, so lucky right now. So, <laughs> okay. Well, I don't really know how to, I don't know how to breathe right now. Okay, anyways, <laughs> I still have a lot more decisions to open, but I just wanted to say, I didn't mean to open it, but I accidentally did open it because Berkeley's not supposed to come out for like two more months. Okay, anyways, that's the update. <laughs> Okay, I don't know what this, <laughs> same day, just opened Berkeley. I don't know what this one means, but I just, I just got an email from USC with an update as well. But here's the thing, I did apply to a scholarship at USC, so this could be a rejection. But I didn't know it's, um, I didn't know when it's supposed to come out. I just got into USC as well. <laughs> or something I'm like oh my gosh and I've been selected I've been selected as a finalist for the USC Merit Scholarship which would receive full or half tuition <gasps> wow <laughs> I think I should call dad wow that's amazing thank okay you. <laughs> thank you mom love you, love you. <laughs> okay just got home from school but in sixth period while we were watching Pride and Prejudice as a movie because we just finished one of our passage analysis essays in AP Lit, I saw that I had an email from Emery, which actually I knew that that was coming out today because they sent us an email yesterday. And it said that I'm selected as a finalist for the scholarships and I'm accepted. So <laughs> I'm really excited about that. And wow, I can't believe that decisions are starting to come out because this is just it's unbelievable. <sighs> okay, anyways, I'm really excited. I really like Emery. So I just got home from ballet, but after school, I got an email from Michigan saying that I was accepted into LSA honors. And I don't have my reaction because it just popped up right away. But I'm so excited and really grateful because I did not think I would be getting into the honors college. And the essays I wrote, I really meant what I said in them, but I was nervous that they wouldn't be good enough. So... I'm really excited <laughs> and grateful that this is all happening. Okay. We're in the school parking lot leaving. Hey Here's friends. Going. Okay. I didn't know you Chicago was coming out today. I don't expect, I mean, You don't Chicago. need to, who cares? Who cares? Literally, who cares? I got rejected. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. I guess I just got to take that. Yeah. Oh, but the, the application officer person seemed so nice when I gave them my updates. <laughs> okay. Said, I'm not taking calculus. <laughs> okay, so earlier today I found out that I was accepted into American University and I got the presidential scholarship. So that's $20,000 a year. And I'm really excited because that's one of the schools where I applied to legal studies. And in DC, I just think that would be a really good environment. So I'm really excited about that. And then I got an email that Northeastern decisions should be posted. For context, I got deferred in the early action round, so I'm just going to go ahead and open that right now. Okay, I got waitlisted, so I guess I'll take it. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll take it. Okay, we are opening up UCLA. Whoop, whoop. Well, okay, waitlisted. Waitlisted? Yeah. At UCLA? Yeah. I mean, that's kind of what I wanted. Fascinating! We'll take it, we'll take yeah, it. Yeah, accept it. Accept the, the waitlist. Okay. Wow, go Bruins. Sounds good. <laughs> okay, so I totally forgot to do this update, but while I was on my way to go hang out with the court tonight, I got rejected from UC Irvine, so 
I guess today is not my day for UC decisions, but my fingers are crossed that next week's decisions will be a lot better. Oh boy. <laughs> we are in Boston for choir. This is day two of being in Boston. Hello. Hello. <laughs> We're clearly tired. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. It's okay, like it's I'm it's probably uh, I'm probably scared. I'm just a riff. Either way. <gasps> <gasps> oh my god! 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 Oh the main context that I feel like I should give for this though is that <laughs> I'm expecting to be fully like flat out rejected because after I submitted, I looked back at my application and I realized that I copy and pasted the same paragraph twice in a three paragraph essay. So <laughs> that's embarrassing on a lot of different levels. But yeah, <laughs> basically I, I don't think I don't think I'm getting good news from Vandy. Honestly, the more I think, oh, by the way, I'm, wear I'm wearing a Vandy shirt. Okay, but anyways, I think this is a pretty embarrassing experience because I don't know how I didn't catch that, but it's fine, I guess. Okay, wait list, you know what? That's so nice of them, considering, <laughs> just considering. Um, okay, I will completely take that. I thought I would be completely rejected and I think it's generous that they gave me a spot on the wait list. Okay, so we are at Panera celebrating Kira's birthday, which by the way, I just, I want to show the camera this. We made these eggs that color me mine, and since we have a golden bear with us, um, I gave her a cow egg. Let's open up Georgetown. <gasps> oh, I'm sorry. Okay, we are at Grandma and Grandpa's house, and I'm going to open my Barnard decision. These dies with date. Wait listed. Okay. And the wisdom to know the difference. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, hold on. Let's start with U Pen. Just, I chose this one randomly. This should be. Okay, we're starting with UPenn, just because it's the first one I have. I didn't load them all up though, so. Okay, expect rejection, maybe a waitlist if I'm lucky. And if it's a letter and you have to... I got into UPenn! Yeah, Mom, I... Oh my gosh! <laughs> Congratulations! Thank you, God. <laughs> I wait. I don't even know how to like. I just don't. You know, I don't know what to. I don't know how to comprehend that. It just feels like it was a mistake or no, something. Oh, you earned it. <laughs> wait, girl. Okay. You you oh my so gosh. Hard. You penned. That's fantastic. Mm -hmm. It's cold. That's feeling awesome. really blessed because I don't feel like I deserve that. Okay, hold on. Next is brown. Maybe I should do this one's traumatic because oh. I already Oh rejected. What? Oh that's emotional because <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. this again. I can't but even worry about bad. it because I got it. You got it. Bad. Okay, next is Dartmouth. <sighs> which, okay, wait, I, sorry, that was the, the lamest reaction ever to you, Pen. Why did I have the worst reaction? Why are you, oh, you're not in frame. Why did I have the worst reaction? That's so exciting, but I think I, I should have prefaced. I've had the worst day ever, mm -hmm. and I'm exhausted because I took four tests and I wrote an essay today. So right before this, I was just dreading all of this, and I... <sighs> I think I'm just, I think it'll hit me later, right? Yeah, it'll hit you later. 
Plus you're bracing yourself because you have more to open. I think it's also just that I'm not really... I got into Dartmouth too! Wow! <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, that's so exciting! Congratulations, you have so many choices! I'm so lucky! No, you just, you work so hard! <gasps> it's open Cornell. This was the essay where I felt like I showed them who I am, and I don't think I did that in any other school quite the way that I did for this one. I think this was my, probably, I got into Cornell today! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Wow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Okay, okay, wait, let's oh, do Princeton. Going. Let's do Princeton because I messed up, so like no. it doesn't really matter. I forgot to send them an essay that you have to send a graded essay and I messed it up. Okay, fine. Yeah. Rejected. I didn't expect to get in. Let's next go for I think I should do Columbia because okay, for Columbia I submitted the wrong major. Oh yes. <laughs> and then I had to email them and say, I'm sorry. <laughs> Which, did it go th I don't even know if my application really went through because I did mess up pretty badly. Okay. Oh, so that's, yeah, okay. Do I even have an account? Okay, update. Waitlisted. Cool. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> I submitted the wrong up. major, yeah. whatever. What do I have next? Let's do Duke. Waiting list. Waiting. Cool. Yeah. Let's just go for Harvard. See you. Oh. Mm -mm. Oh, waitlisted. Oh, wow. That's amazing. Wow. Thank you. Yeah, that's great. Okay, so this last one. <sighs> Yale is tough because I know I can't expect anything, but. I loved, like, there has never been an experience where I, I, I mean, it was even online. It was an online summer program, and I felt that I needed to be there for the next four years because the experience of being with the other students, mm, yeah, being with that. the Yale undergraduate students and being with my professor, it was incredible. And I, <laughs> I felt really encouraged to learn. Watch me get rejected. Beautiful. Rejected. <laughs> okay. Okay, wow. Is that all of them? Yeah, that's all of them. Congratulations! Oh, I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Oh, you work so hard. Everything led up to this. You work so hard and sacrifice so much. No, you sacrifice so much. Thank you. So proud of you. Thank you. Oh, I love you so much. To God be the glory. To God be the glory. <sighs> Whoa. Okay, I think I should call Dad. That's awesome. All right, so the last school is Stanford, which comes out on April 1st, of course. I don't have a video of this for a couple of reasons, but mainly because I didn't think that it was going to be relevant since I wouldn't get in, but also because my dad and I were about to board a flight and it felt a little bit weird to prop up a phone and film anything, but I do have videos of my reaction. So I think you can infer what happened from this reaction. Here you go. Off to London. <laughs> Off to London. In our little pods. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't, I, oh, oh my God. Oh Dad, my God. I'm going to Stanford. Oh, you're going to Stanford. I'm going to Stanford. I'm going to Stanford. The plane just took off and I opened it right now. I didn't even film it because I thought it wouldn't matter. I know. And you got to Bomi. Bomi, congratulations. You deserve every bit of it. I'm so happy. You, you deserve it. Oh my gosh, Bomi. Bomi. Good job, Bomi. Oh, I'm going to be in the same house as the fallout that caused injury.
Okay, I really hope you enjoyed watching all of those videos. I just wanted to remind you though that your mindset with how you go into all of this can really transform the entire experience because about halfway through, you can see that my mindset really shifts. In the beginning, I was really easily devastated and heartbroken about things. And later on, you can see that my friends and I just laugh about some of the decisions and we take it much more lightly because in all honesty, things are going to work out and you don't need to ruin your entire day or your entire week off of one decision. Remember that when you submit an application, these people don't get your whole story. And even when they get what they receive on paper, they only get to see that paper for a few minutes. So I wasn't a straight A student. I didn't have a perfect transcript and I certainly wasn't at the very top of my class, but I really tried to convey who I am in my essays and throughout my application. And all you can hope to do at that point is show who you are in the best way that you can. So I wish you all luck with your process and I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching.